A baby girl was on the brink of death when a nurse had the idea of putting her with her twin sister in an incubator. But no one could have imagined that a miracle would happen. Keep watching to explore what happens next. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more content like this. Kylie, an experienced and dedicated nurse, was nearing the end of her grueling 18-hour shift at the hospital. As she peeled off her uniform, thoughts of much-needed rest beckoned her home. Wow, what a tiring day, she muttered to herself, utterly exhausted. Throughout the day, she had encountered a deluge of cases ranging from cardiac emergencies and amputations to accidents with severe injuries. Working across various hospital departments demanded different skill sets and an immense amount of patience and empathy. Despite the challenges, Kylie always devoted herself wholeheartedly to her patients, providing each with special attention. The clock on the wall indicated that she had a mere 20 minutes left before she could finally leave for home. I can't wait to take a shower and collapse into bed, she thought, feeling every muscle in her body yearning for rest. Proud of her work, Kylie acknowledged the undeniable physical and emotional toll that her long shifts took on her. After an 18-hour stretch, her need for rest was undeniable. However, just as she was about to depart, the sudden sound of screams echoed down the hall. A pregnant woman had arrived at the hospital in labor, and one of the obstetricians, visibly overwhelmed, dashed towards Kylie. Please help me, Kylie. You're the only one still here. She's delivering the babies, and I need assistance. Surprised by the urgency of the situation, Kylie felt an adrenaline surge, pushing aside her exhaustion. The babies couldn't wait. They needed her help. With a newfound burst of energy, she rushed to lend her expertise, ready to assist in bringing new life into the world. As the gravity of the situation dawned on Kylie, she swiftly donned her uniform, her exhaustion replaced by an unyielding determination. With each step towards the maternity ward, she felt a surge of urgency propelling her forward. The scene in the delivery room was tense with the mother gripped by panic and pain at the premature onset of labor. Facing the distraught mother, Kylie exudes calmness, her voice steady and reassuring. We'll do everything in our power to ensure the babies are okay, she promised, her hands moving with purpose as she prepared for the imminent birth. Aware of the critical nature of every passing second, Kylie collaborated closely with the medical team orchestrating their efforts to safeguard the well-being of both the mother and the twins. Despite the challenges posed by the premature birth, Kylie remained resolute in her commitment to the task at hand. With her expertise and unwavering determination, she navigated the complexities of the situation, drawing strength from within to provide the best possible care for the mother and her newborn twins. Every action she took was infused with a sense of urgency and purpose, driven by her unwavering dedication to the well-being of her patients. The nurse's extensive training and experience had indeed prepared her for moments like this. Yet each premature birth presented its own unique set of challenges and uncertainties. With meticulous attention to detail, she ensured that every aspect was meticulously prepared for what lay ahead. This evening promised to be both exhausting and rewarding, serving as a poignant reminder of why she had chosen nursing as her calling. The birth of the twins unfolded as a race against time, shrouded in tension and apprehension. The mother, already weary and fraught with anxiety, underwent an emergency cesarean section due to complications. Are the girls all right? Please, someone tell me something, she pleaded repeatedly, her voice quivering with the profound concern that only a mother can feel. Beside her, her husband mirrored her anguish, tightly grasping her hand and desperately searching the doctor's expressions for any sign of hope. Please, tell me if our daughters are all right, he implored, his voice heavy with emotion. As the medical team worked swiftly and efficiently to bring the babies into the world, the atmosphere in the delivery room was tense. Upon their birth, the extremely premature twins were immediately intubated and carefully placed in separate incubators, their fragile forms a stark reminder of the challenges they faced in the days to come. Each moment was crucial as the medical team embarked on the delicate task of ensuring the well-being of the newborns, their efforts fueled by a shared determination to give the twins the best possible chance at life. Watching the little ones, Kylie felt a squeeze in her heart. They were so fragile, 
barely bigger than 25 centimeters. My God, they're so small, she thought, wondering about their chances of survival. Seeing the parents crying, the nurse approached with words of comfort and support. We're going to do everything we can to make sure your daughters are okay. We want to see them strong and healthy too, she said, trying to convey a mixture of hope and realism. The couple thanked her, hanging onto Kylie's every word like a beacon of hope amidst a sea of uncertainty. They stood by the incubators, watching every movement, every breath of the little ones. After a grueling shift, Kylie finally made her way home, anticipating a peaceful and restful sleep. However, instead of finding solace in her bed, she found herself consumed by thoughts and worries about the twins she had helped deliver. Even as she tried to relax in her bathtub, surrounded by soothing bubbles, her mind remained preoccupied with questions about the future of those little girls. She knew that the baby's mother had a rare infectious genetic condition that could potentially affect them both. Were they born with the same disease? The uncertainty gnawed at her, rendering the hot water of the bath ineffective in calming her agitated mind. As she reflected on the days to come, Kylie understood that rigorous observation, tests, and possibly more challenges awaited the twins. Despite her exhaustion, she felt a deep connection with the children she had helped bring into the world. She knew that their struggle had only just begun. And as a nurse, she was committed to doing everything in her power to help them navigate the difficult path ahead. With these thoughts weighing heavily on her mind, Kylie finally succumbed to her fatigue and drifted off to sleep. She was acutely aware that from that moment on, she would face difficult times caring for the twins. However, she was resolute in her determination to fight for them every step of the way, drawing strength from her unwavering commitment to her patient's well-being. As the days passed, the entire hospital rallied behind the development of little Louise and Mel. Despite it not being her usual area of work, the nurse who had assisted with their birth, Kylie, made it a point to visit them during her breaks. She felt a deep connection to the girls and was determined to follow their progress closely. Kylie's presence and dedication were a source of comfort to the parents, who spent countless hours by the incubators, watching their daughter's every move. In her conversations with the parents, Kylie sought to instill strength and hope. They are little fighters, she would say, and we are all here for them. Her words were a balm to the worried parents, offering reassurance during their time of uncertainty. Despite the optimism surrounding Louise's surprising progress, challenges began to emerge. While Louise, the older twin, showed remarkable development for a baby born three months premature, her sister Mel struggled to keep up the same pace. Mel's development was slower and her health more fragile, presenting a new set of challenges for the medical team. Despite the setbacks, Kylie remained steadfast in her support for the twins and their parents. With unwavering dedication, she continued to offer comfort and encouragement, determined to see the little girls through their journey, whatever it may bring. The parents' anguish was pretty visible as they struggled to comprehend why their daughter wasn't improving. Tears streamed down the mother's tired face as she voiced her confusion, while the father, consumed by frustration and fear, pleaded with the doctors for answers. What can we do? Is there anything that can be done? I want my daughter to get well. She has to survive, he implored, his grip on his wife's hand tightening with desperation. Despite the doctor's best efforts, they were unable to provide a definitive explanation for Mel's condition. Unfortunately, Mr. and Mrs. Brown, we don't understand what is going on, the doctors admitted with a heavy heart. We're still investigating to see if they have their mother's disease. Louise doesn't have it. That's been proven in tests. But Mel, we haven't been able to conclude anything yet. Their words, delivered with a blend of professionalism and compassion, offered little solace to the distraught parents. From afar, Kylie, the nurse who had grown attached to the twins, felt a deep sadness wash over her. The bond she had formed with the girls made the situation more difficult to bear. However, just as the situation seemed dire, it took an even more alarming turn. During one of her breaks, Kylie witnessed a moment of panic as Mel's skin began to turn purple, her breathing growing increasingly rapid and dangerously weak. The urgency of the situation was evident, 
sending shockwaves of concern through the hospital staff and amplifying the parents' already overwhelming anxiety. As the parents stood next to the incubator, their cries of desperation pierced the air, echoing their fear and anguish. The medical team rushed to Mel's aid as the situation quickly spiraled into a critical state. Mel's weakening heartbeat left everyone in the hospital in a state of shock and sadness, their efforts to stabilize her proving futile. When Kylie arrived to visit the babies in the distressed couple, she found herself alone with them in the neonatal room, faced with Mel's dire condition. Driven by a mixture of desperation and intuition, Kylie felt compelled to make an unconventional decision. I'd really like to try something if you'll allow me, she said, recalling cases and studies she had read about twins where proximity seemed to promote better development. Proposing the idea of bringing the sisters together defied usual medical practices, especially considering the mother's suspected genetic illness. However, the gravity of the situation called for extraordinary measures. Putting the twins together posed risks, Kylie acknowledged, but she also recognized the potential power of their special connection. With the girl's mother pleading for any attempt to save her daughter, Kylie knew she couldn't ignore the opportunity. Acting with a determination that surprised even herself, Kylie seized the moment. With extreme care and delicacy, she gently lifted Mel from the incubator, removing the devices that connected her. Every movement required meticulous attention as the fragile baby fought for her life. Come on, Mel, you need to be strong now, Kylie whispered, her voice trembling with emotion. As she carefully positioned Mel next to her sister Louise, the room was charged with tension and anticipation. With swift yet gentle movements, Kylie secured the devices on Mel, knowing that time was of the essence. Placing Mel next to her sister was a moment fraught with emotion and uncertainty. Kylie worked quickly, ensuring that Mel received the oxygen she desperately needed. The little one couldn't be without it for even a single second and Kylie was acutely aware of the weight of responsibility resting on her shoulders. She finally succeeded in placing Mel next to her sister Louise. A sigh of relief escaped her lips. With bated breath, she carefully monitored the monitors, her heart pounding with anxiety and hope. The twins' parents stood by the incubator, their emotions palpable as they watched every movement, every breath, their hands clasped together in silent, mutual support. Please, let this work, the mother pleaded, her gaze unwaveringly fixed on her daughters. Kylie, having ensured that Mel was properly settled and receiving oxygen, took a step back. She knew she had done everything in her power, and now all they could do was wait. I hope the connection they say exists between twins can help, Kylie thought to herself as she observed the sisters together in the incubator. With a sense of resignation, she informed the parents that she would leave them alone to be with their daughters, and then she returned to her shift. Little did anyone know the events that would unfold next would defy all expectations and leave an indelible mark on everyone involved. As Kylie was about to leave, the sudden entrance of the doctors into the neonatal room brought a moment of tension. The obstetrician, upon seeing the conjoined twins lying next to each other, was nearly taken aback. Are you crazy, Kylie? Don't you know they can get contaminated? The obstetrician exclaimed, already moving to separate the babies. Shocked and angry, she questioned Kylie's decision-making. However, Kylie, defending her choice, tried to explain her reasoning, but she was quickly interrupted by the obstetrician, who insisted that such decisions should not have been made without her permission. The discussion escalated, with raised voices and differing opinions filling the room. The obstetrician was already lifting the incubator lid to separate the twins when something unexpected occurred. A small miracle seemed to unfold before their eyes as the monitors tracking the baby's vital signs showed a surprising change. Mel's weak and irregular heartbeat, which had almost disappeared, began to gain strength, synchronizing with the beats of her sister Louise. Perplexed and stunned, the obstetrician and the rest of the medical team watched in disbelief as the monitors displayed this remarkable turn of events. In that moment, Incredulity gave way to admiration as they witnessed the inexplicable connection between the twins, defying all logic and expectations. As the doctors whispered in disbelief, unable to comprehend what they were witnessing, Mel's heartbeat, which had been on the verge of failure, miraculously normalized. Rushing to conduct every possible test, 
they were astounded by the sudden turn of events. Meanwhile, overwhelmed with emotion, the parents wept tears of relief and happiness at the sight of their daughter's heart beating vigorously once again. Oh my God, our little girl, they exclaimed, thrilled by the newfound hope that had emerged. It felt like a miracle, a sign that their precious Mel might actually survive. One of the doctors marveled at Mel's strength, noting her remarkable recovery. And Kylie too was overcome with emotion, her heart pounding in sync with the babies as she witnessed this incredible turnaround. Over the following days, the extraordinary continued to unfold. Mel began to react phenomenally, improving spectacularly. Her once pale and purple skin returned to its normal color and her organs began to develop properly. The two sisters slept cuddled up in the same incubator, with Louise seemingly offering silent support to her sick little sister. It was a sight that defied belief, the two sisters hugging each other, their bonds seemingly playing a crucial role in Mel's recovery. And as the months passed, against all expectations, little Mel transformed into a strong and healthy baby, a true medical miracle that left everyone in awe of the power of resilience and the unbreakable bond between siblings. Kylie's decision to unite the sisters in the same incubator was not just a bold move, it was an act of bravery and intuition that ultimately saved the twins' lives. What began as a story shrouded in despair and fear transformed into one of resilience and love. The courage displayed by the nurse, coupled with the inexplicable bond between the twin sisters, ignited a flame of hope even in the darkest hours. Following the miraculous event in the neonatal room, Louise and Mel's story spread rapidly, capturing the attention of not only the local community, but also the national media. Dubbed as the Miracle Babies, they became a beacon of hope and inspiration. The hospital where they received treatment gained widespread recognition for this extraordinary case, further solidifying their reputation for exceptional care. The parents of the girls became frequent subjects of interviews, sharing their emotional journey and the unbelievable events they had witnessed. They spoke with gratitude and admiration for Kylie, the nurse whose brave decision changed the course of their daughter's lives forever. Kylie's recognition for her intuitive and heroic actions stemmed from her deep understanding of the special bond between twins, a connection she experienced firsthand as a twin herself. Her decision to unite Louise and Mel in the same incubator was not only influenced by studies, but also by her personal experiences with her brother Kevin. Despite the lack of scientific proof, Kylie's belief in the power of twin connections guided her actions. Her intuitive understanding, coupled with her empathy and compassion, ultimately led to Mel's miraculous survival. As Louise and Mel left the hospital months later, surrounded by applause and admiration, Kylie's role in their journey was celebrated. Her humble mention of studies and fascination with twin connections belied the profound impact of her personal experiences which played a crucial role in saving Mel's life. Deeply touched by the bond she had formed with the family during their time in the hospital, Kylie's relationship with Louise and Mel transcended that of a mere nurse. To the girls, she was a loving aunt, a symbol of hope and unconditional love. As Louise and Mel grew, their strength and happiness were evident to everyone around them, supported by the special connection they shared. Kylie's presence in their lives continued to be a source of comfort and inspiration, reminding them of the incredible journey they had overcome together. The story of the Miracle Twins and the intuitive nurse became a poignant reminder of the untapped power of human connections, particularly those between twin siblings. It reinforced the belief that sometimes this inexplicable bond can bring healing and miracles even in the darkest moments. If you like the story, surely the next video that's appearing on your screen will move you too. Don't forget to activate the notification bell so you won't miss any of our next videos and see you in the next story.